the band Cause I'm about to score Put the rock in my hands I'ma give them some more I be moving too fast Gotta watch it in slow mo Lightning in my blood Electric with the flow Ay, Turn up the band Cause I'm about to score Put the rock in my hands You already know Bros, you checking the scope You ain't even close I'm blazing the trail Y'all just inhaling the smoke What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Reggie from HBCU Spotlight, and I'm back with another banger. As you can see, 87% of the channel's viewers are not subscribed. So hit that subscribe button and notification bell so that you will be alerted anytime that I upload a video. Without further ado, let's get into it. This is the story of yet another trailblazer who is out to bring black cottage back to prominence. This is the story of Sean Chappelle the second. Chappelle is a six foot two, 181 pound safety in the class of 2021 from Durham, North Carolina, where he attended Southern High School. He was a three star recruit, the 75th ranked player in North Carolina, and the 157th best safety in the country. He was on varsity for all four years of high school. He is a long, rangy defensive back that uses his length and frame to make plays. The 130k out the gate, they like swerve, stay safe. I'm like, man, y'all late. Yelling free me, I'm like, I've been in the crib all day. I'm in Cali thinking how I come from the hallway. Long as I never go back to He racked up 80 tackles, seven interceptions, and one fumble recovery. With those stats in mind, it brings up the famous saying It's not what you do, it's how you do it. Chappelle had 80 tackles, but he laid the boom during a majority of those hits. Not only is he a hard hitter, but he is a big defensive back and a ball hawk. Several schools were jockeying for his services. Those schools were Liberty, Campbell, Arizona State, Syracuse, Appalachian State, Georgia Tech, and North Carolina a and On April 28th, 2020, Chappelle committed to Georgia Tech. I'm sure everyone is thinking the same thing I did while doing my research. Why didn't more local schools show interest? His high school football coach, Darius Robinson, answered that question. He said, I think recruiting is strange sometimes. I can tell you that Sean is a very good football player, and maybe the schools thought he wanted to get away from home. In an article published shortly after Chappelle's commitment to Georgia Tech, Coach Robinson talked highly about him. He said, I have two girls, and if I had a son, I would want him to be just like Sean. He is a great young man. He is a model citizen, a family man for sure and his discipline. Coach Robinson pointed out that Sean is one of the first ones in the field room, the first one on the practice field, and the last one to leave. He is eager to better himself as a player and a person. Chappelle has been a cornerback since his freshman year at Southern. I will play him anywhere in the backfield, said Robinson. I have that much confidence in him. Chappelle committed to Georgia Tech on April 28th, his 18th birthday. But later he committed from the Yellow Jackets just five months later. On September 29th, 2020. I'm not sure exactly why he decided to decommit. 
I wasn't able to find anything. If you know the reason, please comment that down below. On February 3rd, 2020, North Carolina's very own decided to stay close to home and signed a letter of intent to play for the North Carolina A&T Aggies. This is all about this brotherhood that's in this room. And then the players that have come in forward and the ones that's gonna come out. Let's give it up to each other. And let's celebrate this moment together. Let's show them why we champions. North Carolina a and has won a lot of games and produced several pros over the decade. Their head coach, Sam Washington, has been with the program. He was quoted as saying, When we first got here, we would not have been able to get guys like this to even have a phone conversation with us. It tells you how far we've come and advanced as a program. We came away with talented players. Some are going to help us right now. Some are going to help us down the line. To coincide with that, North Carolina a and is looking to step up their level of competition. The 2021 season will be their first season, no longer in the MEAC. Instead, they will join the likes of Campbell University, Charleston Southern University, Gardner-Webb, and fellow HBCU, Hampton University, just to name a few, in the Big South Conference. Coach Washington went on to say, the satisfying part about this class and the guys we signed in December is that we competed against some good Division I programs to get these guys here. I'm not sure if Chappelle will be a day one starter, but all I do know is that when he hits the field, he will make his presence known. Being in a college weight training program will do wonders for the already big defensive back. North Carolina a and has had several players make it to the next level. I have a feeling Sean Chappelle II is a name that we will hear for years to come. Thanks for watching the video. If you made it to the end, type in Motivate Culture in the comment section. Let's keep growing and supporting the historically black colleges that we all love. If you enjoyed the content, please subscribe, leave a like, and a comment. We're on the road to 10K. From us over at HBCU Spotlight, we're rooting for you, Chappelle, and looking forward to seeing you shine on the field. We out of here. Peace. Let you know. Yeah. If I pull it out, I'ma let it blow. Boom. You know I'm hot. Oh, my girl, we right. my father, we made it. I'm the way for the rest of the day. I think they scared of the lake. Gotta burn my